Hi ladies, how you guys doing? Now tonight we're creating this look right here with Unique's Addiction Palette Number One as well as Unique's Mineral Pigment in Provoked. Now this palette is amazing. It has seven different shades in it, four shimmers and three mattes, browns, neutrals, gold colors, so it looks good on everybody. This is my most requested look that I get and the look that I wear the most. So sorry this has taken so long for me to get this uploaded, but I'm so glad it is. So I hope you guys all enjoy. I'm gonna first prime my eyes with MAC's Pro Longwear Concealer in the shade NW25. Then I'll be grabbing Unique's Mineral Pigment in Provoked. This is a perfect transition color and I use it every day. Now I'm taking Morphe's M441 brush and applying it to my creases in a windshield wiper mode. Now I'm going back and forth, back and forth, making sure that it's nice and blended. Now this color, you won't be able to see at the very end, but this color will make sure that all those colors nicely blend and transition into each other really nicely. So I'm just going back and forth with small circles right in the crease and windshield wiper mode. All right, now just make sure that it's nice and blended. Blend, 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 blend. Now I'm taking Unique's Addiction Palette Number One and the color Chipper and Forthright and mixing them together. Now I'm using Unique's Crease Brush to apply these two colors. I am packing it on the outer corners of my eye. Now I wanna stay below that crease line, but I wanna get all that color right on the outer corners. Now, I'm going to be basically making an arrow pointing outwards. Now, this is a great brush. It's a little bit bigger than a pencil brush, and it's really gonna pack on that color exactly where you want it. Now, I'm taking Max 217 brush, and I'm lightly using the color Chipper and blending this out. Blend, blend, blend. This is the key to getting this look. So make sure that you are doing little circles and windshield mo motions back and forth, back and forth until it is nicely blended and you have no sharp lines anywhere. And it's okay if you get the eyeshadows on the outer corners of your eye. We are going to be cleaning that up later. I will show you how. This is why I love doing my eyeshadow before I put any kind of foundation, powder, concealer, because I can clean up my under eye or any type of fallout that may fall while I'm blending. All right, so just don't be scared. You can go on the outside. You can mess up as many times as you want because we are definitely going to be uh, creating a nice sharp line um, after this. Then I'll be taking Unique's Cream Shadow Brush and spraying it with Max Fix Spray. Now for the star of the show and we'll be using on our lids is the color Brassy. It's a beautiful gold color. Now I'm taking that eyeshadow and applying it on the inner corners of my eye and all the way to mid way of my lid. Now I am dabbing it onto my eyelids. I'm not sweeping it across, all right? I love using this method. It turns pretty much all my shimmer eyeshadows into a nice foiled look without um, using a foil shadow because those can tend to be very, very messy. Um, just make sure that you don't soak your brush with Fix Spray. You lightly mist it, all right? You don't want the brush to be soaked at all, but it gives you a nice, beautiful look and it will make your shadows pop even more. Now I noticed that I wanted my creases to be a little bit darker, so I'm taking Fourth Right and using Unique's Crease Shadow Brush. I'm applying it right on the corners of my creases just to get a little bit darker. Now I started this look with using Unique's Mineral Pigment in Provoked, so I'm gonna end with it. I'm just taking a little bit and making sure that all the colors are nicely blended together and there are no harsh lines. Now I'm taking Unique's dual-sided brush. I'm absolutely obsessed with this brush. I actually own two of them. That's how much I love it. Now with the liner side of the brush, I'm gonna be taking the color Forthright. It's a nice deep dark brown and lining my bottom of my eyes from the outer corner all the way to the inner corner. Then I'm gonna be taking the other side of the brush and yes, of course, using my favorite color, provoked, and I'm going to be blending those two colors together. I like my under eyes to be nice and smoky. This is a perfect brush to blend, 
but making sure that it's not getting everywhere. So a little bit bigger than a pencil brush, but I love this brush. Now for eyeliner. Now I'm using Unique's Liquid Liner. Now this is not available right now, but because everybody is absolutely obsessed with this, I'm sure it will be soon, maybe in the up and coming March product reveal. Now I've never been good at winged eyeliner. It's one of the hardest things I had to learn when it comes to makeup, but this actually is the only tool that allows me to get a nice, good wing eyeliner without getting it all over the place and having to draw it a million times. So I absolutely love this pen. Now for the magic. Now I'm using Unique's Shine Makeup Wipes. These are amazing. I can go on and on about them, but right now I'm just showing you how I clean up my under eyes. I just take the wipe and swipe it across my under eye, cleaning out any fallout and creating a nice sharp look. All right, this is gives me a nice professional clean look. All right, and this is why I do my eyeshadows first so I can clean up my under eye, have any fallout. If I was wearing any kind of foundation or concealer, it'd be taking it right off. So this is why I do my eyeshadows first. For my eyebrows, I'm using Unique's brow liner in the color medium. I'm not gonna go too much into it. I already have a brow tutorial. If you wanna watch it, just check out my other videos on my YouTube channel. Um, but basically I'm just filling them in and I'm using the spooling and making sure that I'm brushing in upwards motion and then filling it in and brushing, all right? I'm gonna be taking Unique's Skin Perfecti Concealer and applying it to my brow bone. I'm using the color Organza. And then, of course, I'm going to be blending it out. Now, because we have so many different colors in this palette, why not just use one more? So with Unique's dual-sided brush, I'm going to be taking the color Elated and applying just a small amount underneath my brow bone um, to give it a nice little highlight. All right, now my brows are totally not wanting to work with me, so I'm using Unique's brow gel in the color Medium and applying it to my brow my brows, all right? I don't use it every day, but when my brows just don't wanna work, I have to use it. Oh my goodness, I can't believe I forgot my favorite part uh, is eyeliner. I'm using Unique's pencil eyeliner in the color Perfect, and I'm putting it on my inner waterline to finish this look, all right, ladies? This is a completed look with my mascara, lipstick, and face makeup. Now, if you want to see anything else in the future, just let me know by commenting below. Thanks for watching. Bye.